What do these people have over our government? What sort of deal has Norway and Canada made that trumps the uh, Aboriginal rights of my people, our people? We now understand that these fish farms represent a threat to every river system on the coast. Mm -hmm. That the Fraser River salmon stocks that migrate out to the ocean face a very clear and direct threat to not make it to the ocean. They move their tactics from the land to the ocean. Time immemorial, we lived off the ocean. They declared war on us from day one, and they never changed the thing. We have been overwhelmed now by this idea, the economic idea that the economy is everything. And that's the battle that we're really up against. It's about our people. It's about the salmon. It's about everything. It's about the land that we're on. And we express our support, our solidarity, but most importantly that we hold up our hands and and tell you how grateful we are. Very powerful to uh, be standing with all women. Um, I know a lot of people wonder where where the men are but us women hold a lot of strength too and it's showing at midsummer with having all women on the front line and taking a stand. We're life givers. We we have um, our children and our future children to think about. I commend my great niece, my niece here, who's standing up for our rights, our power to who we are, to our lands and our waters. We're staying until we win this. We're we're a peaceful group and we're making every effort to keep everyone who comes here safe but we are committed to staying as long as this takes, as long as these farms are in our waters, we're going to be here.